Hey, what is going on, Madden family? It is our first legend weekend of the year, and I know but this video is a little bit later. I was having some issues getting some points. You guys see it. If you guys were here last year, we, we brought the hoodie back. The hoodie is back for good luck. It's going to help us pull amazing cards. So let's look at uh, who came out. We got three new legends today. Michael Vick, amazing. Of course, he's going to come home. Uh, Reggie White, and then a limited edition Bryant Young. Interesting. He's new. And he's about as cheap as he's going to get because you can quick sell him for 500 So these people are stupid. Uh, let's compare him to who we have currently on the team, Mr. Gerald McCoy. He beats him pretty bad everywhere. We might have to pick him up. Might have to pick him up. Then... Let's look at, uh, we'll just go by alphabetically. We got Reggie. Where's Reggie? Reggie. Michael is down to 1.1. He's under a mil. Reggie White's 350K. Le is, is, is Reggie the glitch? I mean, he's pretty good. He's, he's pretty good. He's pretty good. Uh, and then, of course, Mr. Vic. Under a million coins. Obviously, he's going to... My guy still got Baker. Might have to power Vic up. Conductor on Vic. Get, oh, my God. But we're opening Legend Fantasy Packs today. Uh, but they're not with coins. You know, last year we ripped a ton. Just a ton. A ton. Of uh, these packs with coins. Every weekend, probably like... 16 to 24 of them easily every weekend and uh this year well they're not with coins we don't have the coin stack to do it anyway but they don't even offer it which is kind of disappointing uh so we're, let's kick it off top i've seen so many people pull the bryant young in their topper so why not us so let's st let's start big let's start big and hope it only gets bigger and better and an 86 Steve Young, not exactly what you were looking for in your topper at all, especially when you see people pulling a 500k card. But hopefully our pack like is fine. I mean, obviously, we pulled the Ed Reed the other day. So that was really nice. So it's going to be hard for me to get upset uh, when we pull. Now, what I would recommend you guys do when you do open these packs, always pick the rookie cards if you happen to see them. They do sell for more than the normal cards. As well, uh, ooh, elite. Okay, we'll take an elite. Now, I from what I've seen as well, I've watched a lot of people open packs. I've seen some videos and just seen some pictures of people's packs. The first round this year does not seem very good. The second round, slight potential. Um, and then the third round, obviously, you get like an 84 plus guaranteed one legend slot. But I've also seen that they don't flash blue for the legends in this pack, which is kind of disappointing. So we'll see. But, I mean, anything red is good. We get a double elite. Okay. I mean, we'll obviously take two elites in round two. Now, this is where this is where we got to get big. LeGarrette Blunt coin version. Okay. I'm going to save the legend slot for, for last every time. Because if we're going to pull Vic, that's, that's where he's going to be. And then 83 Bruce Smith. What does this LeGarrette Blunt sell for? 30k let's go look i don't know i don't know what jordan howard sells for or the bruce smith i just i just don't know i don't know i uh the my knowledge on the market is good but for a lot of cards i haven't pulled i just don't i don't know where they're at i have no idea what the, the cards are worth so jordan howard is Clearly less. So we're probably going to have to take that LeGarrette Blunt, right? There, unless 83 Bruce Smith. Bruce Smith is worth more, and I just can't see that. 20. So we'll take the Blunt. You, know, you, you, you always take the Blunt, right? And we'll do this. Now, this is another reminder. If you guys are new to Mutt this year, if you are not sure which card goes for the most or who you want to take... Back out of the pack. It saves the pack. You can go back in. Make sure you get the maximum value every single time you open one of these Legend Fantasy packs. So first pack is not terrible. Uh, we get a couple golds here. 
Uh, and then low silvers. All right. If we can get a lead in the second round every time, that would be pretty clutch. Uh, but it's not happening there. So at this point, we're just going to take the highest overall cards. Uh, keep in mind, you probably, like, if you see any, like, high overall bears, you probably want to take them. They're expensive. Legend 85 Reggie White. I'm sure that's okay. Or Alvin Kamara. Again, Reggie White 85 Kamara. I don't know. I don't know. Now, you could have Mutthead up, but Mutthead slows my computer down to a ridiculous level. And, well, I'm not going <laughs> I'm, to, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to do that. Uh, Reggie, 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 Reggie. 85, looks like he's about 30k. That's not terrible. It's not terrible, but it's not great either. And Kamara is about the same. Yeah. We'll take the Reggie just in case we want to do him. But I don't know. For 1,500 points, you're getting a lot more value out of gold premium packs than these packs. Like, you need like a decent, you need an 86 plus pull in these to even remotely make them worth it, in my opinion, because you're missing out on so many slots where uh, you could get other cards and add other value. When you use gold premium packs, but of course we're gonna we're gonna open the promo packs, the legend packs. We want the best chance of getting something Michael Vick related. Uh, so that's what we're gonna do. <sighs> Eighty-seven Justin Houston. That's pretty good. This 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 pack good. Amos pretty good as well. And eighty-three Vick Justin Houston's clear. He's easily the most expensive of the bunch for sure. Uh, that's a good pack. That's a good pack. I had Justin Houston before. He's very he's very good. I wouldn't call him budget necessarily, but he's still a very good card. Uh, and his price has probably dropped a little bit. He's probably like 60 or 70K at this point. Uh, I got just low silvers. Like You can't even get high silvers there. Jeez. <sighs> Come on. Well, that is a box of disappointment right there. 81 right guard. 84 Janoris and another 85 Reggie will take it. This, I mean, we're halfway. Uh, we've probably made 225 so far. Not exactly what you want. You'd like to do a little bit better than that for sure. But. These, these packs might not be the move. Oh, and I, mean, I, I hate saying that because I love Legend Fantasy packs. I love leg, I, I, I love all this stuff, but unless these packs, my packs get better, I'm just, the value is just not there. You could I could have opened gold premium packs and been just as happy, honestly, uh, up through this point. I would have pulled much more value out of those. The only reason you would open these is because you're you're shooting for the stars. You're shooting for the sky. Like, ah, 87 Vic. That's good. Why not 89 Vic? 89 Vic I would, I would really like. Maybe that card's expensive. 82 Bruce Smith. Double. We get a double legend round. 84 Michael Kendricks. Not who we want. 91 Michael Vic. 84 Sean Taylor. Uh... We'll take Sean. We'll take Sean. That Vic should be that Vic's our best pull so far, probably. I don't know what his price is, but I'm sure he's at least a hundred K. Has to be, right? Uh high silver, high silver, okay. Gold, 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 gold. And these are all low golds too. What the hell? <sighs> I don't even know. I don't even know, guys. I don't even know. I, I, I've seen a lot of people have good packs. Um, so I think it's possible to have good packs out of these for sure, for sure. Um, I just feel like the like your floor on these packs is not great. 
if you know what I mean, the floor, like the worst you could do, it's not great. The ceiling is really, really high. Last one. Wow. That did us no favors to go get Vic. No favors whatsoever. All right, let's go look and see what we got. Let's. I mean, tell me you're expensive. So that's not terrible then. 185k for that card. Wow. Wow. Okay. So I mean, that's not the worst thing. The Steve Young was our second highest card, 50k. So that bundle actually wasn't terrible. It really wasn't. Um, how much is the rest of Vic? How much is the rest of Vic? Because I assume he's got what an 89, right? The 89 is probably the most expensive, and he's. It's 645. Mm. Okay. Okay, well we're going to cut this one off here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. We're going to we're going I'm going to work on getting Vic, but we'll be back later for another video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for joining me. First Legend weekend it means a lot to me. The hoodie didn't work today, but I'm out. Peace.